dear students uh, welcome to my another lessons i am going to actually i am going to start uh, very wonderful question wonderful explanation and also i am going to discuss with you if you have any difficulties you can ask me any question i like to use your mother tongue also for your further explanation and also i like to give the boost and my expression my motivation that will help you to promote your skills so my questions is very easy the, the, the questions are very easy the question will be taken from known to unknown from easy to difficult so first one you can see dear students the questions okay it is very 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 easy so don't feel sad so i like to help you by reading the question and explain with a lot of ideas so that idea will help you for anyone to promote your life that's why can you see look at the question please start yes i can read it complete the dialogue yes complete the dialogue between kamal and rajan kamal and rajan complete the dialogue between kamal and rajan use the words given okay in the bracket so in the okay in the box write the correct letter in the blank the blanks are waiting for you this is a one blank 2 3 4 5 6 six blanks are there one is first one is done for you the first one is done for you here dear students write the correct answer very important some answers may be correct you can feel correct answer and correct letter also very important don't write this answer the answer of the letter letter should be written letter should be written for the blank so first of all we can read i can explain drive drive what do you mean drive drive yes yes we have we have the driving license automatically a person can okay drive his car drive his motorbike yes that is called he is the driver drive travel travel you know well dear students we have to travel to kandy we have to travel to kalampo so using okay take using the uh, vehicles we have to go from one place to an, another place with the help of the vehicle that is travel ro ro is the yes uh, boat travel that mean when we go when we use the boat in the on the in the sea or pond or in the river we can use that uh, traveling matters row walk is you know well yes uh, walk using our legs we can walk fly so every bird uh, every bir bird flies in the sky ride ride you know well yes uh, if we, if i have bicycle i can use i can ride it why because of the ride so there are dif different situation uh, for our action for the yes for the vehicle uh, cow can be used you know well drive travel row walk fly right so yes, yeah, let's see kamal says hey rajan you are late 
why do okay why do you always dash by train so train you know well dear student train is non word train so kamal says hey rajan why are you late why are you late why do you always he asked the question why do you always dash by train so b is the answer travel travel by train in tamil a ni appo train il travel pandrai yes rajan says no i am not late i always come to school by train okay my i i always come to by come to school by train he likes to travel by train so he comes to school by train he always come this is the way this is the action daily daily he has used daily always travels by train to school so he proves he proves the idea then kamal says i see do you ever dash your bicycle when you see when you see the bicycle automatically your answer should be given right already i told you know f is the answer if you can't understand these words through this okay through this word bicycle you can write right yes let's see rajan says yes sometimes how do you come to school how do you see he asked the question rajan asked the ask question how do you come to school kamal says well i just dash i live close by it will this this phrase and word will help you to write your accurate answer how he lives close by near the place of the yes school or near the place of is the uh, working place maybe near the place the situations he lives near the situation near the place close by kittadil irukra arigamil irukra valiyal do you okay do you want uh, do you want car do you want okay do you want uh, boat do you want bicycle that is not needed so close by this close by will help you by walk 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 is the d i just walk i just walk i live close by so rajan says ke hey, lucky you he appreciates he appreciates the idea his walking system because he lives close by so you know i am learning to dash my father's tractor so here dear student like the already i told you bicycle when you see the bicycle you have given the answer right here tractor father's tractor when you see the father's tractor automatically you can write drive a uh, a is the answer i am learning to drive i am learning to drive in my father's tractor he is saying yes kamal says i would love to dash a plane one day here dear student like bicycle father's tractor here yeah, plane when you see the plane automatically you can write fly yes fly is the answer fly fly is the answer e me too i know how to dash a boat when you see the boat already i told you dear students what boat can be used in the water yes here boat boat automatically when we see the boat we can write row row is the answer c yes yes nice actually everyone can get full marks for this question this is very simple question but i have taken uh, to read and explain this question i can't take i can't read i can explain i can't no need to explain no need to explain or no need to suggest for this question
I want, we want to explain a big question. Big questions are waiting for you. Okay, behind this question. Let's see. Okay, I can read very quick. Kamal says, hey Rajan, you are late. Why do you always travel by train? Rajan says, no, I am not late. I always come to school by train. Kamal says, I see. Do you ever, do you ever ride your bicycle? Rajan says, yes, I, yes, sometimes. How do you come to school? Kamal says, well, I just, this is the, okay, this is the answer. Walk, I just walk, I live close by. Rajan says, hey, lucky you. You know, I am learning to dash my bike. So, I am learning to drive my father's tractor. Kamal says, I would love to fly a plane one day. Rajan says, me too. I know how to row a board. Oh, really? Yes, that is a very fantastic question, dear students. I think... I have so when I read this uh, sentence, you can understand the situation. You also can make the communicative skill with your friends. That's why I take this opportunity. That's all you can see. Yes, uh, this question is very important, dear student. This uh, it is related with the uh, grammatical idea. This grammatical idea mean automatically you have studied in grade 9, 10 the active passive voice. You have started your session in grade 9. Oh yes and 10. But my I am going to start here with a question. The, that is final question which has been given uh, from your past paper. They have, okay, they have given this question from your past paper. I did not uh, say a great date or uh, year, but you should understand, you have to understand this type of question. This is the final question as well. So, I can give you only 30 seconds to read and understand it because you are the brilliant one. You can go through this question very quick. Your time starts. Yes, uh, I have provided one minute. I think you can do it this session with very wonderful active, so wonderful uh, moment. So I can explain what is the, uh, yes, in the, in service, so in, in, in the, grammatical approach. I like to give the chance. I will explain the way of the idea with my technical ways. You can see. So, you are going to do dear student passive form. Passive form should be taken. So, use the passive form of the verb given within brackets. So, verb has been given within the bracket. Using with passive form. Automatically, you, you know well dear students. In the passive form, active voice should be given as the passive. Active has been given into passive. Active has been given passive. How? Ravi, Ravi eats mango. In this case, dear students, Ravi is the subject. Eats is the verb. Mango is the object. S V O. So when we say when we write the passive form, object should be taken first. We have to give the chance for the object. Object what? Mango. Mango should be written first. Then immediately we want to write the helping verb. So when we see this is the this is sentence is the present tense. How? Because eat plus s. It is the present tense. It is the past tense. 
and eaten is the past participle. Here, eat is, has been given automatically, we can guess that is present tense. Present tense verb is very important. So, mango, then helping verb should be given. What helping verb is? Because the present tense, no? Is. Mango is not singular. Is should be given there. Then, eat has been given as the verb 3, past participle. Eat, eat, eaten. Why the preposition should be given there? Then finally, Ravi should be written there. Ravi. Mango is eaten by Ravi. That is passive form. Active voice, you know well. Ravi eats mango. Passive is mango is eaten by Ravi. So here, there are two things available here, student. Helping verb and verb 3. Past participle. Form very necessary. Sometimes the mangoes, uh, mango has been given as the plural. We have to write ah. Oh. Then verb 3 should be written there. Here, instead of eat, instead of eat has been given eight. Eight is the past tense. So here, Helping verb only can be changed as the was. Was over, that is a past tense form of the helping verb. Here, mango was eaten by Ravi. Already I gave Ravi eats mango, mango is eaten. Here, mango ate Ravi. Ate is the past tense. So, helping verb should be written as the past tense. Was. I am at feet. Can you understand what I told you? Clear? Yes. Okay, I can go to the question. Yes, you can see the student. Yes. In this case, okay, there uh, there is a wonderful role play conversation. Through this conversation, they are bring they are bringing out. The passive form. We can see. Let's see the question there. And un okay, understand the question and solve this problem. Karandu says, Hello Raja. What are you doing these days? I didn't see you for a long time. Raja says, Well, Tarandu, we are getting ready for the sports meet. Tarandu, oh, I see. Raja says, already we dash group into three houses by the teachers. Yesterday, the students dash within bracket select for different events. So, we want to find it, dear students. What answer? Maybe correct here. Tarandu says, so, are you taking part in any of the events? Raja says, yes, I am a member of the relay team. Next week, we dash within bracket train after school by the coach. Tharandu says, really? How nice. Who is organizing the final ceremony? Raja says, that dash within bracket organized by the prefects with the help of the principal. A special meeting dash within bracket call for by now. Tarandu says, how about the tents and the refreshment? Raja says, they dash with bracket provide by the parents. Tarandu, Tarandu says, it's going to be a great event. Can I, can I also help you? Raja says, sure. The winners will get cash prize. Can you please help with that? Yes. Good. Dear student, you know well, they have provided verb. Verb has been given. Yes? Verb has been given. Yes. From this verb, what will you do? Already I told you, so the noun, uh, so object has been given as the noun here. After seeing this noun or subject, we want to find, we want to write helping verb and verb 3. Helping verb and verb 3. Helping verb 
and verb 3. Here, helping verb and verb 3. Helping verb, verb 3. Then, like this. Your visas. I have guided you. Let's see. Tarandu says, Hello Raja, what are you doing these days? What are you doing? This is the present continuous. What are you doing these days? Actually, at the present, what is he doing? I didn't see you for a long time. I did not see you. Yes, he, this is the past. He says, he said, okay, his view. Raja says, well, Tarandu, we are getting ready. The present continuous. We are getting ready for the sports meet. That is present tense. We are getting ready for the sports meet. Oh, I see. Raja says, already we dash group into three houses by the teachers. Yesterday, the students dash select for different events. In this case, how can you solve this problem? You want to solve this problem, how? It is easy. They have provided some words. That words will help you to find out the answers here. How? Anyone from you? Can you open and say me? Yes. In this sentence, you can see already. Already has been given. Already. And then, full stop is there. After providing the full stop, they have a starting sentence with yesterday. Yesterday is the past tense. That is the new one, new sentence. In this case, in the, for the first sentence, has, be, has been given with the help of the already. Already. When you see already, that is present perfect. Present perfect. You know when, dear student, present perfect, calf has plus verb 3. Calf has, calf or has, then verb 3, past participle should be written there. Like this, already, already is the present perfect. So already we, what is the helping verb? We have, we have, we is the plural, we have, group should be written as the verb 3. Group G R O U P E D. Already we have grouped into three houses by the teachers. That's all. That's finished. Sentence has been completed. Yesterday, and yesterday is the past tense. Get. Yesterday is the past tense. Yesterday will help you to write accurate sentence. So find out the accurate tense. Yesterday is the past tense. Yesterday, the students, so past tense helping verb should be written there. Students is the plural. So past tense was or were. Already I told was or were. Here were should be written there. Why? Because students, students is the plural. Were. Select should be written verb 3. This is the regular verb. Selected. S-E-L-E-C-T-E-D. Selected. Students were selected for different events. Yesterday, the students were selected for different events. So, I have completed two, two questions, two blanks and have given the idea. First one, dear student, already has been given, already has mentioned PP, present perfect, cap has, cap for has. Here, V is the plural. V is the plural. So, we have to write have and verb 3. That is also regular verb. We have grouped into three houses by the teachers. Yesterday, the another field is there. Yesterday, another time. Tense. Yesterday is the yesterday. Past tense. Yesterday, the students were selected for different events. Clear? Have you understand? Good. Third to say, so are you taking part in are you taking part in any of the events? Are you taking part? Taking part is underlined by the are you taking part? Are you taking part in any of the events? 
Are you taking part is the present tense. How? Because R is there. Present continuous. Present tense. You know, what is the helping verb for the present tense? Am is R. That's why this is the present tense. He asked the question using with present tense. You answer also should be given as the present tense. So, if they ask the question present tense, using with present tense, your answer is also given as the present tense. That is why I expect from them. Clear? Yes. He asked, Karan to ask the question, ask his question, are you taking part? Are you participating? Are you taking part in any of the events? Raja's answer, yes, I am a member of the relative. He says, I am. He is also considered helping of am. I am a member of the relative. Next week, oh my god, next week, next week has been changed the tense. Tense has been changed. Next week, next week, so in Tamil, that is future. That is future. Yes, that is future. That is future. Okay, future tense. Future. Future tense should be given. So, full stop, then future tense has been started. Here, full stop, the past tense has been started. Here, full stop, future tense has been started. Future helping verb will or that. Will. So, when we say, when we write the field will helping verb to this sentence, we have to add another word be. Don't forget. And also it can be che it can be it can be considered for the modal words also. Can, could, uh, shall, uh, may, might, those also, those words will get be also. So you know, first of all, dear student, you understand in a blank repair the future, either gala and blank repair. Future. Next week is the future tense. So, future will take future. Will is the helping verb. So, we won't write will. Don't forget. We can write will. Immediate. Then, additionally, we have to we have to write be verb. Be should be written. Don't forget. Be should be written. Then, as usual, you can write verb 3. Train. Trained. Trained. Clear? That's why. We will be trained. We will be trained. How? Because next week is the future. Next week future. So, we have to consider helping of will. When we write the will, we have to additionally add, we have to add B also. Then, as usual, you can write the verb 3. Verb has been given within the bracket. Drain. Trained. So, will be trained. Don't forget the answer. Right? It is very necessary. Many students facing the travel are uh, facing this, uh, may, many travels for this question. We understood. Evidence is there. Next week. So, will be trained after school by the coach. So, coach. They are, so, they are coach, they are trained by the coach. Clear? That is the idea. First one I told you, present tense. That is a perfect, present perfect. Then, second I told you, past tense. How do you find the word I told you yesterday? Here, third one, third, I told you third is the next week. Next week is the future. Future can be considered will. Will, will should be added with the be. And verb 3 also should be there, should be written there. This is the video student. I am giving you the chance. How can you analyze? How can you give? This is the numerical idea. That's okay. Your maths view, mathematical idea. I like to give. Many students can follow and do and get the uh, good marks for this question. This is the idea because you already had the prior knowledge also. Okay, let's see the next one. Tarundu says, really? 
how nice kids okay tharan do appreciates kids view who is organizing the final ceremony dear student when when they ask the question you want to understand what type of question uh, okay asking by them and also ask by them and also what tense they are using here what type of tense they are using here who is using who is organizing is organizing present continuous pc present continuous here is sister helping verb and verb one and then ing form you know well they are here present tense has been used dear student right? present tense yes answer is also should be considered the present tense then we can see raja said that dash organized by the prefect that the help of the principal yes here in this case in the in the full stop from the full stop sentence we could not find any tense here eda tense therinja paarga eda kaalatha kurippada words irukuma da you can say eda avade tense e kurippada kaalam irukka you can say no but you can understand this idea this idea will help you to write the answer i asked the question who is organizing the sports so my view also using the present continuous my friends are organizing yes so your answer should be given the present tense you automatically you can write the present tense helping verb first one is because the passive form the helping verb is that is present then verb 3 that is organized by the prefect with the help of the principal a special meeting dash with a bracket called for by now now is also you can there are so many evidence lot of evidence those evidence will help you now is also present tense present continuous present tense so automatically i can't i can't wait for the Uh, yes uh, other balance of the sentence automatically i can write the necessary answer here automatically i can write meet is meeting is and called i did not understand other balance of the sentence automatically i write because of the now now indicates me to write the present tense so passive is there no passive automatically we won't write helping verb and the last question how about the tense and the refreshment he asked how about the tense and the refreshment yes yes you can say they dash provide by the parents so how about the tense and the refreshment he asked such so, tense is going on present tense automatically he asks another question how about the tense and the refreshment he asks the key responds for the question they dash provide by the parents then it is going the present tense the balance of the sentence the from i think from here we can understand all the sentences all the sentences all the sentences after after okay after this statement i can understand all the sentences has been continued with the present tense so we can write this is also using with the present tense they are provided ed provide regular verb by the parents this is the nature you have to understand the technique i think so normally uh, when we start when we talk when we use the tense or uh, sentence or the situation we have to use our brain idea also what does it say i have used the brain power especially how can we use the techniques when we find the subject or the subject as the noun we can write the helping verb then verb 3 so how can we divide decide how can we decide what type of tense in a sentence we can understand the tense the tense the type of sentence will contain tense through the tense through the words the, through the words of sentence we can understand the tense 
already I told you, now, yesterday, uh, already, uh, next week, those are our ideas to write our passive form. So dear, this is very wonderful, awesome. I can't say a lot of question for you, but this question has been appeared for you in your final exam paper. Sometimes you may meet this question. Okay. Okay, you are very tired, no? Yes, dear students, I like to consider that time. I can meet you in my next class. Okay, good luck. Kalvi TV, put the Buddha Nigel Chicago, wouldn't a couldn't part the Makala, the mother Facebook Matum YouTube Pakate likes a yingle.